It's the end of June, the beginning of July. June favourites! Oh yeah! Hair. I have, I do my hair different ways. I sometimes have it going back, I sometimes have it going to this side, that side. I have, I do all kinds of different things with it. I do my hair and then 20 minutes later it'll just fall flat. Like it'll just fall into my face when I wear it back. So it was my mum that actually said, she went, the reason why your hair falls flat and why it's limp a lot of the time is because you wash it far too much because your hair needs natural oil. You want the natural oil in your hair so you can start because your hair needs oil, just like your skin needs natural oil, your hair needs natural oil and the natural oil in your hair is what your body produces to condition your hair, keep it in good condition but obviously it gets to a stage when you really need to wash it because, you know, it's just meh. But last week, I've been doing it now for like what, two, two weeks, two and a half weeks now and I've noticed a massive difference. It does fall a lot better in in place. Like it, like I can go like this now, like that, and if you see, it stays in place. Whereas if I had done that two weeks ago, I'd have gone like that, and it would have just all just fallen to the side and all into my face. I can leave my hair for about three days, but after the third day, it needs to be washed. But then I was in Boots the other day, and I was just walking down the um, hair care. I got to the dry shampoo section and saw this. Which is the, you know what it is, it's the Petite Dry Shampoo. And I got the Coconut Exotic Tropical one. It comes out like a, as a powder. It comes out as a spray, but it's a powder. And you spray it here, it's white. And then you get, and then you just kind of like rub it and like disperse it into your hair. He's a miracle worker. So, yep. I'm getting to a point now with my hair where I don't, I don't like that look of hair when there's loads of product in there. Not like, look like you've poured a tub of super glue on it and it's just set rock hard. While I was in boots, I also picked up this. Uh, uh, got to be pow powderful volumising styling powder. I'll blow dry my hair either to the side or back, or whichever way I want it. Pour this into my hand like that, go like this and just rub it all in my hair, all over and literally just do this. Just do this everywhere, all over it. And it lit sure this is in boots for £3.50. Can we all please just talk about the fact that hair fever season is upon us and where everybody's dying from it? Especially me. I can't even like leave my house without like looking like I've done 10 rounds of Mike Tyson because I'm like... <laughs> These are really good guys. Um, it says relief from the symptoms of hair fever, skin allergies, pet allergies, mole power allergies, house dust mite allergies. Along with the uh, Perites tablets, obviously because you're rubbing, rubbing your eyes with because the hair fever is so bad and my eyes were getting really sore, I've been using these, which the Marine Bright and Moist Eyes, these were in my skincare routine that you saw in my last video. I can wake up with really sore eyes, really red, really sore streaming, put these in, literally a, a minute later, the soreness has gone down a lot, the redness has nearly almost faded, and they really do brighten and moisten your eyes, so these guys really invest £3 or £4 from Boots, really, really good. And also with hair fever, because I've been rubbing, rubbing, rubbing my eyes all the time, my eyelids have become really dry. I've never experienced, whenever I've had hair fever before, I've never, ever, ever experienced dry eyelids. Didn't even know that was a thing, but apparently you can because I got them. All my eyelids were like really dry and sore and flaky. I was in boots and I came across the simple section and I picked up, it's the Simple Kind to Skin Moisture Rose Hydro Cream. Now, this is a hydro cream, and from what I can gather, it's basically a lotus flower goodness for optimum hydration, which is what I needed on my eyelids. And now, this is really, really good, and it really does work. You can try that. So, um, the next thing is a fragrance, and this is the... This is the Dolce & Gabbana number no. 3. Um, the smell is... I'm not going to know, actually. So with the with the aftershave, which is my next favourite thing, came this bag. Now this bag has been quite literally a lifesaver. This bag, but it came this came free with the Dolce & Gabbana aftershave. So when I got this, the lady served me, and she was like, "Oh, you also get a bag with it," and she gave me this. And it's, it's great, it's literally, it is the perfect size. It's just great, it's great for, it's perfect for when you're travelling, it's perfect for 
on the plane, it's perfect for overnight stays. If you're a light packer, you could get a couple of days in here. For the gym, um, it's great. Oh yeah. Shoes. These are my shoes. These are from... See, because I've always known these as Clark Originals, and like I say, these are from Matalan. Do you notice this? Can you please leave it in the comments below? I've always known this shoe as a Clark's original shoe. Now, this shoe is not from Clark's, but it's just like the Clark shoe. It's real suede. But then, when I bought these, they were called desert shoes. This tube as well. What am I doing? And they're just really, really cool, real suede, really cool, stylish. I love them. I wear them every single day. I with a pair of skinny jeans. Cool. Love them. Hi. The next thing is these jeans. These are from River Island, and these are the River Island stretch skinny jeans. The denim is stretcher. Can you see that? Look. On the top. All the way up. I always have trouble finding jeans for the simple reason that I am a hobbit and I should live in Hobbitland. A 30 waist and a 30 leg. This is in a lot of places that I've gone, I'll get a 30 waist and it'll be great, but then the leg will be far too long. These were £25 from uh, River Island, which is a bargain for a pair, for a pair of good quality, strong jeans, 25 quid, you're laughing, spot on. And the last but least thing that I've got is, I for ages now have been wanting a Fujifilm Instax camera. And I said to mum the other night, and this was like literally two nights ago, I said to mum, I was like, oh I really want a, you know, an Instax camera, you know, I really want one. And she was, she, she started laughing, walked out, and then came back in and went, Danny why don't you say so? She said, this has been in the attic for the past nine years, and I went... I've got one now. And I'm £90 better off. It's an old one. Weighs about 15 stone. Yeah, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe to my channel. I will link my Instagram and my Twitter in the description bar below. You can go and follow me on there. Toodles!